Hey, Queen here. Had a fire in my house last night. It's still standing though. Thank goodness to this guy, the bat safe. I had a lipo fire, which I could not believe. They're, they're very rare. I never thought it would happen to me. I've been charging batteries now for over a year. I know all the safeguards. I practice them all. I know how to parallel charge and all that properly. But something went wrong. I don't know what, but I had a fire. And this is what happened. Look at that. Look at the devastation inside that box. There was four six cell batteries. Look, they've just like disintegrated. Look at all that soot, black. That could have been my home. Now this is cool. Uh, well, fires aren't cool, but they're cool if you have a fire in this box. Let me tell you what happened. I seen smoke coming out of uh, my room where I was charging them and into the hallway. I wasn't in the room at the time, but smoke started coming out of there. I walked in, it was a white smoke, not black. Not sooty, not damaged smoke, a smoke that I've already got out of my house. Just turned a fan on, opened a window, blew it out. You can't even smell it no more, but a white, harmless smoke. Look, these filters filtered it out. No black come out. The box was hot, and that's a double insulated box, but it was hot, so I got two pot holders. Brought them outside here, set them on the sidewalk, and I let this baby burn. I didn't dare open it. I let her burn for about three to four hours, come out, open it up, and wow, I was shocked. The fire. So, man, my, my hat's off to whoever invented this, the guys that sell it. Thank you so much. This is a great product. Ike Queen out.